Chilling late with a bitch from the bayou. Mm, make sure the pussy ball no caillou. Mm, Hadouki yo ass like I'm Ryu. Mm, my flesh on your ass like So there I was furiously jacking off to some wholesome boy ASMR. When suddenly I noticed something out of the corner of my eye. After I, after I finished, after I nutted, I had that post-nut clarity. I figured out something. All ASMR channels are basically the same. Now, what do I mean by this when I say that they're all the same? Well, I mean, they're all the same. They do the same things, they all virtually look the same, they have the same titles, the same tags, the same hashtags. It's all the same, even down to their thumbnails. They are all virtually identical. And I know this because this channel started off as a shitty ASMR channel. I actually still have those videos uploaded. <laughs> There's like two or three of them. And they are not good. I mean, they're not good. And they are very formulaic. They follow the exact same formula that every other ASMR video does. That being anime boy in the thumbnail. Uh, fucking slight improv. That kind of shit. All the same. The only difference with my ASMR videos are that, like, I think most of them have some no effort put in in terms of, like, the picture, or th there's not even a thumbnail. I'll put them up on screen now for you. Again, let me clarify something, because this is the thing. ASMR is a very big community. Uh, it's got a lot of different things. You know, the bubble wrap popping, the mukbang shit. I'm talking about a very specific subsect of the community. I'm not talking about the ones that do bubble pep popping or rustling paper or typing on a keyboard that kind of shit i'm talking about anime ones and when i say anime ones i mean anime ones literally anime ones they have anime profile pictures or they have fan art profile pictures they have anime in all their fucking thumbnails some kind of cute boy or girl usually in the anime style or the manga style if you want to be an absolute fucking degenerate you know what i'm talking about it's the, uh, it's the kind of shit where it's like, uh, boyfriend tries to prove he's the top male for female pouty boyfriend ASMR. Boyfriend sneaks in through your window for a cuddle. Uh, yandere boy, yandere boy, vampire yandere boy, yandere boy. It's all the same shit. It's all just identical garbage. It's all just yandere this, fucking sub this, dom that, it's fucking terrible, it's so unoriginal, there's no original shit in here, it's all the same. Right now, the reason I'm focusing on the, the boy aspect is because these are the ones I listen to, because they, uh, they rock my jimmies, if you know what I mean, they get me, uh, they get me randy, they get me, they get me, they get me horny baby, you know, all that shit. <laughs> but, yeah, it's all the same shit, it's literally all the same shit, here we have another one. Yandere ex-boyfriend breaks in. Possessive boyfriend keeps you to himself. A lot of these seem to be Yandere, like, abusive boyfriend shit. Is this what chicks are into? Should I start, like, abusing my- I'm gonna start- I'm not gonna say that, actually. <laughs> I'm not gonna say that, that'll get me in trouble. Like, right now, I've just searched in ASMR girlfriend. First one that comes up, anime girl. ASMR roleplay, shy girlfriend spends the night with you. ASMR, lying on your girlfriend's chest. ASMR, yandere lawyer, yandere, snuggling with your girlfriend. All of them are anime pictures. Cat girl, what the fuck? It's all the same. It's so irritating. Like, that is honestly my biggest problem with the ASMR community. They're not original. Every single fucking channel is the same thing. They usually have VA or some bullshit at the end of their name. It's really fucking annoying. I hate it so much. Yes, I'm a hypocrite. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> None of them are original. They're all like carbon copies of each other. None of them even do interesting shit. Other than like, I'd say... Mother Child? If that's still her name, let me just quickly search her up. Uh, Mother Macabre. Who's bo who, by the way, I got banned from her Discord channel in literally a day. It took me less than four hours to get banned from her Discord. That was a, that was a pretty good, it was pretty good by my, actually it's not pretty good by my standards, I've been banned quicker. But, uh, she makes fairly interesting ASMR shit. Like, her, uh, her biggest series is, like, Alien Abduction, which I've listened to. Because I'm a fucking weeblet, and I'm a fucking degenerate, and I really, I really like it. I really like the idea of being licked by a big, tall alien mummy. <laughs> Oh, uh, fuck, that's de so degenerate. I'm keeping that in. But the point I'm making is, she's one of the few, like, ASMR people that I'm aware of that actually has some pretty unique takes on ASMR. 
um, like here, um, one of her series, ASMR, meeting a modern Medusa, you know, your classmate is secretly an elder lich, you know, shit like that, that's very, very interesting, like, monster ASMR is something you don't see much, it's always, like, fucking werewolves and vampires and fucking Japanese spirits or some shit, like, it's super fucking boring. She's got Dryder, that's one of hers, or oh, another one that I just saw, Leech Girl. Like, these are cool ideas that are actually unique. As well as that, her actual thumbnails are not dog shit. They actually have effort put into them, and I think she draws them herself, but they look good. They look very nice. They're not just generic anime bullshit. I'll put some up on screen for you now to have a look at. At the end of the day, this is honestly my biggest problem with the ASMR community is simply that they're all completely fucking unoriginal. Um, by the way, yes, I actually do have some friends that do ASMR shit. I don't really talk to them that much anymore because they can go fuck themselves. You know who you are. <laughs> go fuck yourself. Make an ASMR shit. You should be ashamed of yourselves. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Uh, by the way, sorry if my throat I, it, I know it sounds like I'm putting on a voice, but this is how I sound when I have a sore throat. It's hard to explain. I sucked a massive black cock the other day, and I'm still recovering from th that absolute fucking destruction. I'm, I'm, I can barely sit down, to be honest. Like, I'm in so much pain. <laughs> That's... Oh, fuck. Nah, it's staying in. Fuck it. But yes, that was today's video. I'm gonna end it here, because I'm ranting now. I'm just... I'm rambling about nothing. Next video will probably be me talking about, um... Uh, I don't, I don't know. Uh, something to do with Warframe, probably. I'll probably talk about DE's big issue with Warframe and what I think it is. If you like the video, leave a like, subscribe, all that bullshit. Uh, join my Discord. That's the main thing I want you to do. Join my Discord. Um, I like talking to people. Uh, I am active on there. Okay, like, I don't type a lot, but... Just at me and ask me to VC. I know people are shy about that, like, you know, adding the server owner and all that shit. Just do it. I don't care. I'm usually available to talk. I have a very empty life. <laughs> then, boys and girls, I'll see you in the next video. Peace out, children. I don't know. Fuck off. Fuck off. Get the fuck...